Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of V. I am Xenospector. I know I said that that was it for this series. But I, uh, one of my commenters told me about something I didn't know about. Uh, last time on B, we didn't do that. We went, we played some of the custom levels that are in the game. This time, we're gonna go look at something in the main game that unlocks after you collect all the trinkets. I'll, I'd like to thank Kuro MP3 for telling me about this. So you, after you collect all 20 trinkets, you go and talk to Victoria. Wow, you found all of them. Really? Great. I'll run some tests and see if I can work out what they're for. That, that didn't sound good. Run. Wait, it stopped. This is where we were storing those shiny things. What happened? We were just playing with them and they suddenly exploded. But look what they made. Is that a teleporter? I think so, but I've never seen a teleporter like that before. We should investigate. What do you think, Captain? Should we find out where it leads? Let's go. Oh no, we're trapped. Oh dear. Hmm, how should we get out of this? Combine. That's cool. Or you know, we could have just worked back to the ship. Wow, what is this? It looks like another laboratory. Let's have a look around. Congratulations, you have found the secret lab. The secret lab is separate from the rest of the game. You can now come back here at any time by selecting the new secret lab option in the play menu. Captain, have you seen this? With the research and ours, we should be able to stabilize our own dimension. We're saved. Look at all this research, this is going to be a big help back home. Complete the game. One with less than 500 deaths. 250, 150. Complete the game in flip mode. Obtain a V rank in, time in this time trial. So I was right about V rank being the highest. Complete the game in no death mode. That's cool. There's like a trophy room in the actual game. I wonder why they abandoned this dimension. They were so close to working out how to fix it. Maybe we can fix it for them. Maybe they'll come back. This lab is amazing. The scientists who work to know a lot more about warp technology than we do. Look what I found. It's pretty hard. I can only last for about 10 seconds. Uh. <laughs> the ten, there's a super graviton. Which... What you... Uh, really, which... You don't really have to beat it or anything, it's just so you, to see how long you can last in it without dying. 
Apparently it does a trophy at 5 seconds. Let's see if I can get to 5 seconds at least. Uh, this is a lot harder than the other one. Ah, so close. I got, and I unlocked the trophy. Oh, okay. And lot, lot next trophy at 15 seconds, so I guess you get a trophy every 5 seconds. It's a good thing the song that plays for this is really a good song. I got seven seconds there. Yeah, this is much harder than the normal Gravitron. Ah. Uh. You should press enter to stop. Uh, yes, let's return to the secret laboratory. Alright, what does this do? The Super Gravitron is intended for entertainment purposes only. Anyone found using the Super Gravitron for educational purpose may be asked to stand in the naughty corner. <laughs> this is apparently the naughty corner. And now... Uh, and now the captain is frowning. He does not like being in the naughty corner. So, ah, okay. So the trophies for the Super Gravitron go up to one minute. Anyways, since we looked at that, we will now You cannot save in Secret Lab, interesting. My deaths went way up. Super Graviton High Score, best time. 10 seconds, 23. And that's the map, that's the Scion area. All right. So how do I... There we go, quit to menu. And now... And now in the player we have a secret lab selection. To, so we can go and try the Super Graviton anytime we want. Anyways, 
that will be it for this video. Thank you all for watching. Uh, the next time we will look at player created custom levels. I will see you guys then.